So hints and tips to will writers um, and estate planners. Now, from an ethical point of view, um, we encourage, and I'm very much in agreement that charities need to have certain amounts of uh, money get past their way and that you know, they form part of many people's lives. However, it's the understanding to the layperson that how charities potentially um, can require things that unless you're using a professional, um, you could potentially come unstuck. And I'm, I just want to give you an example here from a, from a charity letter. Um, we understand that uh, you're applying for the grant of probate. We'd be grateful if you can prove to us the three valuations that you received on the property. We would also understand that you should have completed a schedule of assets and liabilities and can you forward that to us within the next 14 days. We look forward to hearing from you. Now if a professional is dealing with that estate, that, that's no concern whatsoever because that would be part and parcel of their administration. However, if the family was DIY, that may well send them into a spin.